Hi everyone, welcome to this short video on adding audio files to your Google site. Well, there's a couple ways of doing that. One, you can upload audio files as an attachment uh, to any page or maybe even use a file cabinet style page where you may want to have a, a large number of audio files. But if you do that, viewers will have to download the audio file eventually to listen to it on their computer. Another method would be to embed an audio player on your Google site so they can play it right from your site without downloading. Well, let's take a look at that first method. I'm going to dive over here to my uh, sandbox site and let's say we have a, a Google site page that we would like to place an audio file. Well, if you scroll down to the bottom of your page, you'll see that well, I have already added an audio file here, but you will find something called add files. If this is your site, you'll have access to that link. So if I click on add files, I will be able to go to my computer and locate an audio file that I have created using any audio file creation tool. So here's one that I have here and I'll just click on that. It's going to upload that video file to that page for users to eventually download. Now depending on the size, uh, it will take uh, uh, time to upload. Oh, well, there it is. So I see that I have that when I posted it. And on the far right-hand side, users will be able to click the download arrow to bring it down to their computer to listen to that audio file. If you do that, I might recommend in the body of the page to uh, place a little narrative or a comment about uh, the audio file and where it's located because some pages are quite large and they don't automatically see these. Well, another method you might want to use if you have a large number of audio files is the file cabinet style page. Now I have videos on the creation of this, but this is what it looks like when you create a file cabinet style page. And you can upload a variety of audio files just by clicking the add file button. You can even click on move to a folder and I can add folders to this and begin to organize these audio files in a variety of ways. So if you're interested in uh, the file cabinet style page, there is a video specifically on creating this style, but as you can see, it will organize those files nicely. But again, users will have to come to the download button to click on download to take it to their computer to listen to the audio file. Well, I hope you found this video helpful. Have a good day.